Hello Fluid Art family, it's me Julie E. If you're new to the channel, welcome back. So lovely to have you join us. Um, I've been playing around with school glue for a long, long time. And <laughs> one thing that I have never been able to do purposely, purposely, is mix it so that I can get decent, lovely cloud pearls and um, that's what you're seeing here I'm still working on it this is back a few weeks ago I'm playing around in the studio and I thought well let's record it just in case I stumble upon it and it works but yeah you can tell <laughs> by this first one er, no it didn't I they were wonky they were weird most of them were from air bubbles popping they never really grew into really pretty cloud pearl cells and so yeah I just thought oh what the heck these are all mixed the same basically as what I do school glue blooms with and just for oh lack of a better term shits and giggles I said oh let's let's do a cloud pearl bloom oh I did that's not what I said I thought what <laughs> that's not what I said I thought uh, let's go ahead and do some school glue blooms and we'll use the cloud mix just to see what happens right so that's how this comes about and I hope you enjoy it but yeah it was it was a fluke and I tested it again to see if I got the same reaction and I pretty much did it was a different um, you'll see in the second one there's a couple scrapes warning you right now um, but you'll see in the second one that I kept that I used an ultramarine violet cell activator I'm not really loving the way that the cell activator celled I didn't get a lot of lacing and stuff but the pearl reaction holy cow I learned so much from doing this and it was just you know it was just out of sheer shits and giggles <laughs> that I did it and sometimes that's when some of the best things in life happen you know you're just in the studio you're not really you know looking for something and it happens so then you have to try and repeat the process and see if it keeps happening and it did but the key was I have to put down that pearl white mix first that has to go on first so that's what I learned from this you can't just add it in a layer anywhere in between your colors or on top of another color like say you have to kind of use it for your pillow I guess if we're talking bloom terms that that um, cloud pearl mix is going to be your um yeah your your pillow and then you will layer your colors on top and your cell activator and then blow it out and yeah i didn't catch that a couple times because <laughs> my head be thick but um but no it, it's it's pretty cool i i'm thrilled with this i can't wait to play some more with um this technique I think they came out really cool especially the last one the last one I'm really thrilled with the pearls on it are so pretty oh my goodness I just love them um, the cloud pearl mix that I make I make 15 ounces of it at a time there are three and a half ounces of artist loft flow white or soft body white okay then there is half an ounce of the deco art americana satin enamel then there is one ounce of the um, vallejo pearl medium all right so you've got those three little parts making five ounces then to that you add two parts of the 70 30 mixture of your school glue pouring medium so one part of the paint to two parts of the school glue pouring medium your one part paint consists of the artist loft satin enamel and vallejo making the one part okay so um, hopefully that's not too confusing uh, I will have it written out in the description 
so that you can follow it and play around with it if you want to experiment do some of your own you know fun stuff um but yeah that's that's how easy it was all my paints are mixed one part paint two parts school glue pouring medium even the pillow uh, even the colors and then the cell activator is one part paint usually an amsterdam opaque to three parts of that same pouring medium that's it school glue water mix it together add it to some paint that's it it's that easy and look at that there there's the dry results of the first one isn't that beautiful I think it's absolutely lovely so here we go again going to try it for a second time you can see I did not put it down as my pillow the first time around again and so I end up having to scrape this next one right here and um, do it over again don't worry none of the paint was thrown away there's no waste I scrape it all up I put it in another container and then I throw it in one of those bottles over there and uh, yeah so yeah I, I, I don't waste my paint when I'm experimenting it'll get used again all right I'm gonna put on some music for you and I will see you towards the end we have a pretty cool announcement if you haven't heard already from Dave and Janice um, we are going to do just once a month trains. Yep, third Thursday of the month, each month, is when our train will be. We will not be doing them every single Thursday anymore. Our lifestyles are different, you know, than when we first started our channels and stuff. So we're making the proper adjustments. We will still probably drop videos here and there we will still be doing collabs with other people and everything but for our little train group and ourselves we are just doing a once a month premiere on the third Thursday of every month so and mentioning Dave and Janice please go back check out their channels check out their videos they were right before me first was Dave at 10 then just Janice at 10 15 I will have their links down in my description also with a complete playlist so you don't miss any of the fun um, and uh, yeah I will see you back here for dry results
pretty are these oh my goodness I absolutely love them hey guess what yeah not to toot my own horn but it's my birthday this weekend Woohoo! want to give me a great birthday present hit that like button subscribe tap that notification bell to all so you don't miss any of this cool fun all right so yeah look at those pearls oh my gosh they're big they're juicy they're yummy I love them yeah, I'm not a big cool fan of that um, cell activator, that ultramarine violet, but, you know, you can't have it all, all the time, right? <laughs> I absolutely love this. I have to try it some more, so look for these in the future. And the next Thursday that I will see you on will be May 16th with our special guest Janet from J Witty Creations. Woohoo! Until next time, loves and hugs y'all. Bye!